some answers after a fiery night. These are taxpayer dollars that should have gone for the operation of city government but did not, went for personal gain. Last August, the Casey City Hall building burned down in a suspicious fire just hours before a scheduled visit by state auditors. Citizens told KCCI they had petitioned for an audit of the city's finances. People have seen things that are suspicious and and people are starting to question that. After recovering records from multiple sources, the state auditor's office discovered from 2008 to 2014, there were nearly $300,000 of improper and unsupported disbursements and undeposited utility billings. The city clerk used for credit card payments for personal purposes versus city business. Auditors say former city clerk Dorothy Dillinger told investigators she issued unauthorized checks to herself and used credit cards for personal use. That included more than $54,000 of purchases from Amazon, Avon, and Victoria's Secret. That impacts, of course, the financial health of an entity, but also the public trust, um, whether in this particular city or just in government, period. The mayor didn't want to comment on the audit, but he did tell me that the city is moving forward with plans for a new building. Residents tell me they just want to put the past behind them. Well, it is disappointing, and I know it's very disappointing to the people. Shame that all the records and everything burnt, and you know, I, I just feel like somebody's got to answer to it. The state auditor says some of the money also went to the public works director. So far, no charges have been filed. The state auditor says they are working with the city leaders to put better measures in place. The Department of Public Safety says the fire is still under investigation. In studio, Rose Heafy, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.